A Colorado judge ordered the suspect, accused of gunning down five people at a gay nightclub, held without bond on Wednesday, during the suspect's first court appearance. The public got its first glimpse of Anderson Lee Aldrich, 22, who made a virtual appearance from jail, before 4th Judicial District Court Judge Charlotte Ankeny. Aldrich wore a sleeveless protective jail smock during the court hearing. The defendant appeared lethargic sitting on a bench with their head tilted to the right. The suspect was barely audible when the judge asked the accused gunman to identify themselves. Aldrich was released from a hospital and transferred to jail on Tuesday, officials said. The accused shooter was treated for injuries suffered when club goers disarmed them. The extent of the suspect's injuries are not clear. In addition to keeping the defendant held without bail during the brief El Paso County hearing, Ankeny also ordered prosecutors to share sealed arrest warrant material with Aldrich's defense lawyers. Idaho's been nearly four days since five people were slain at Club Q. Aldrich has been charged with five counts of first-degree murder and another five counts of allegedly committing those crimes as part of a bias attack. The 22-year-old is accused of walking into the Colorado Springs LGBTQ club late Saturday night with a high-powered rifle and opening fire, killing five people. The carnage could have been worse if not for the fast action of Army veteran Richard Fierro, 45, and another person who jumped on Aldrich to stop the gunfire, officials said. Defense attorneys for Aldrich filed routine court documents for their client this week, identifying the suspect as non-binary. The accused gunman was called MX. Aldrich by public defenders, who noted that their client uses they slash them pronouns. This is a developing story. Please refresh here for updates. David K. Lee is a breaking news reporter for NBC News.